today. And uh, during that signing ceremony, he said something stupid like he typically does. Take a look. And they have, they've been working on this for years and years, and I'm curious why wasn't it done a long time ago? And also, well, I guess the answer to that is because now I'm president, we get things done. <laughs> we get a lot of things done that nobody else got done. Okay. It's the centennial celebration. Yeah. Why didn't we do it a long time ago? Because it wasn't 100 years since then. No, look, it's not. It's, it's, it's not because fun I'm to make president. Fun. It said nobody wanted to do it. They didn't want to do it at 98 years or 95 years because I wasn't president yet. It's okay, look, Cenk, it, let's not make fun of someone who is obviously stupid. Of someone who is obviously stupid, okay? Okay. Um, so let's just, let, let's help them out, okay? So let's look at the definition. Okay, Trump, let's look at the definition of centennial, okay? It's an adjective, relate, <coughs> relate, <coughs> excuse me. Relating to a hundredth anniversary. It's, so. it's just so sad. It really is. <laughs> How come we didn't do this before? Why didn't we celebrate the 100th anniversary earlier? Because it's the 100th anniversary right now, you idiot of idiots. And then he takes credit for it. Oh my God, the suffragette movie. You're gonna take credit for celebrating that? You of the legendary, infamous, I just grab women's genitals without asking. You're gonna try to take credit for celebrating the 100th anniversary of that. I mean, of all things to try to take credit for. God, I mean, look, the, the two, I get Trump, I, I understand. So it's a, it's a country filled with 330 million people. Can you find one who is of tiny intellect? Who was born to a wealthy father, who was spoiled little brat, who went bankrupt a bunch of times, the overprivileged son. Yeah, you could find one. And you could find more than one. Okay, Trump is one of those guys. It's his followers that are so sad that look at that and go, yeah, that's my guy. How come nobody did the 100 year celebration before Donald Trump? Huh? He's the only one to think about it. Uh, yeah, that's my guy. To think about it. Uh, yeah, that's my guy. Oh God, you're so much sadder than him. Well, I mean, look, I what I question is whether his supporters even see that video. Because like, where are his supporters consuming the news, right? You think Fox is gonna show that video and talk about it like we've been talking? No, they're not gonna do that. The only place they can watch it is when they hate watch us. We see you. Yeah. <laughs> and you know we're right. So, um, and then the media too. Because like, the media is not as bad as the Magna guys, obviously. but. We have to pretend that he's not stupid. Does any has any cable news anchor ever called him stupid? I bet you that, that that might be a firing offense if you said that. When it is the most obvious thing on planet Earth. He might be one of the dumbest people I've ever I've ever seen. Television and said it. Just said it. He just said it. He's and, he, <laughs> and he released a transcript of a call where he asks a foreign government to look into a political rival, which even without quid pro quo is illegal, but he doesn't know. He's George <sighs> Stephanopoulos asked them, if a foreign government gave you material against your opponent, would you take it? He's like, well, of course I take a look. No, that's illegal. And how many times do we have to tell you it's illegal before your stupid thick head gets, is penetrated with a single thought? Right. And also, look, there's there's ignorant, right? You can be ignorant of things, but not stupid. You just don't know. You're not educated on the issue, whatever, right? But he's ignorant and stupid. 100%. Like he won't exercise because he thinks that we have a finite amount of energy, and if you exercise, you are wasting your energy. I mean, that's and that you'll stupid. die quicker. Yeah, that's okay. He thinks that windmills cause cancer because of the noise. He barred. Sar car, okay? <laughs> that's that's what I think of when I think of Trump. <laughs> okay, so uh, and it, it, look, there's no end to it. I can give you a thousand examples of it, uh, but you're not allowed to say things that are obvious in American media. And so anyway, if you are a Donald Trump supporter, which you guys remember, so none of you are, uh, presumably none of you are, uh, <laughs> you should be embarrassed for the rest of your life. Thanks for watching.